I start by coating the entire model, including the axe, in black. That way, if I miss any parts, especially in the recesses, they will just look like shadows. I'd like to try out some other options for uh, basing a miniature, but that will have to wait for later. Ah, mummy robes, the skin tone of champions. Of course, even when you have such a vibrant color, you do need to shake it up. Still pretty thin, more shaking. That's better. I seem to paint with a lot of brown mixed with yellow. It's really good for leather, wood, um, and I guess my shirt. Also, my hair is the color of leather and wood. So is my beard. Gotta have some gray pants. There are certain parts of the miniature that I'll paint slightly off screen for propriety's sake. The overcoat I'm trying to match is my grandfather's deck jacket from World War II when he was in the Navy. It really looks black to me, but because it's a Navy jacket, Think of it as blue, and blue's a pretty good color. I haven't learned yet how to paint black so that it looks like it has any dimension at all. I guess that will have to wait for later. Why did I make a real axe blade? out of real metal, and then paint it. Well, part of it is because I've got to try things out. I also have that ugly glob of super glue to cover up. Little bit of lighter blue on the jacket. Dry brushing to show off the highlights. A little bit of red tone for the hair and beard. Put on a few bronze buttons here. They aren't really on my coat, but I like the miniature to have some interest, even if it's not reflecting what's in real life. Also outline the edges of the collar and uh, pockets in the coat with a lighter blue. look sharp by adding a little bit of white to the edge of the blade. Try to lighten up the skin where the light most naturally would fall from above. As if mummy robes aren't pale enough. I added a bit of white.
Whoa, that is way too much eyeshadow. Gotta do something about that. I finished the eyes and based the miniature without recording, so I'll have to share that some other time. And here we have my doppelganger. I hope you've enjoyed my first Sunday morning mini, hopefully the first of many minis. If you have, please click the like button and even subscribe. 